say so. It's disaster upon disaster upon disaster. Um, last Saturday we were supposed to start recording in our studio and all the equipment was there, everything was there, <laughs> except we didn't have the right cable. And then we were on like a six hour search to find the cable. Nothing, nada, zilch. Uh, so that was a bust last week when it was supposed to be the start date of the original recording. Uh, so today, it's a week later, we went back, like a 20 hour drive in a different direction, got our band technician to set up the stuff. It was all working, was all good in the house, of course, of this person. And then we got back, started setting up the drums, ready to set up and get recording. And what happened? It wasn't working. It wasn't working again because guess what? Another cable is missing. And I'm telling you, we are at the end of our tether here. In fact, there's a ravine. Let's just over it. Let's go. Unbelievable. Typical. Some good luck, please. Once again, no f Only in real life. Okay, so we've been just around three shops looking for this new cable. P PC World. PC World. Which you think does PC stuff. Yeah, so PC World, so a PC cable will be there. But no. no then we no, go to no. DID. Harvey Norman. Harvey Norman. Yeah, we're going to try Power City. We're going to try Power City. And Power City will, knowing our look, be a bust. So then we have to, if that is the case, we're going to have to drive all the way for an hour in one direction to hopefully get the cable and an hour back lose time, studio time, that we could be spending making amazing, brilliant, sexy, beautiful music once again sitting in a car <laughs> frustrated and getting welts on our ass and uh, just waiting for exactly, look at this people standing still in their cars, how dare they this is, it's not acceptable. But really, we're going to uh, Backstreet Dance Studios to learn some uh, moves for a new video. Yeah, there. dance so, studios. Uh, we, we got something special in store. Anyway, hopefully this works. Check in soon. Okay, so we just got back from Power City. Do you think we have a cable? Do you? Do you think we got a cable? Do you think life would give us a break in our recording? No, no cable. So now we have to travel. How long? Uh, it'll take us an hour and a half altogether, I would say. Yeah, we have to travel an hour and a half to get a cable that could have been, we could have just had if we asked for it when we went the second time back 20 hours in a different direction but you know you live you learn and then you make the same mistake again that seems to be what's happening so there you go we've lost studio time but well, we're determined to get it together today it's the last thing we do yeah so uh we'll get it started today no matter what we are we go bust who knows Okay, so after a long haul, we went to this other place. And what happened, John? We got a cable. We got a cable. We don't know if it's the right one yet, but we haven't tried it. Yeah, we haven't tried it yet, but we will, and hopefully all goes well. It's so f something like this. <laughs> Everything. Of course. 
pearl stones always work. Yeah, the pearl stones will work. The problem is, I don't fucking want to change this.
again. It's, it's been quite a long time since Refuge were together in a musical sense, creating or wanting to create music. It's been like, it must be like 10 years or so. And over that period of time, I, I think it's, it's definitely felt like there was a piece missing. Because when we were in Refuge, we always had that feeling that no matter what's happening in your life, you always have an empowerment because you have this thing that's separate from, from, from your, your daily life and, and daily tasks and struggles that you can kind of find some strength in. It was, it was very optimistic and, and energizing, so you always felt empowered with it. So to have refuge back together, it's definitely a very empowering feeling that you have the freedom to create things and find enjoyment outside the, the norm and outside the, the common things you can experience. So it's, it's really nice to be creative with the guys again and, and see the possibilities and have that chemistry and that really good relationship as our band, so yeah, it's a truly really empowering time.
ideally like to achieve is to capture the, the period in time when we were teenagers. So all the music that we had as refuge back then, we would like to record all that material and then have that chapter recorded and complete. So over the past 10, 15 years, we've learned a lot of recording techniques and how to have the material very tight using tempos and things. So we'd like to record them with tempos and have a very tight production, but also keep it very simplified and very true to what it was when we were playing the material. So I think trying to have a very accurate representation of the material we had back then. But there will be some updates because back when uh, we were teenagers, for me, guitar was more of a priority and vocals was something that we kind of didn't take too seriously. So probably spend more time on the vocals and melodies and rewrite some of the lyrics. Wait. 